It's McKenchy Critiques. It is McKenchy Critiques. Let's get something straight yeah. It's called McKenchy Critiques. Not McKenchy Dick Rides Your Favorite Anime. Not McKenchy Dick Rides Your Favorite Anime. Not McKenchy Dick Rides Your Favorite Anime. McKenzie Critiques to McKenzie Dick Rides a Favorite Anime. Welcome to a one off. I have to reiterate one off live reaction to episode one of Banana Fish. I was recommended this by one or two people on my Twitter, I think even my comment section. Uh, so, Banana Fish, I'm reacting. This came out recently. This, this anime started recently. I'm only checking out one episode. This isn't going to be an ongoing seasonal. Towards the end of this video, I'm going to talk uh, at a little bit of a length about what's next. What's next for the. Uh, old animes I'm doing, what's next for the season of animes I'm doing, so be sure to stick around for that. For now, let's check out just a one-off um, live reaction to Banana Fish, see if I like it, see if it's something maybe down in the future I can I can start or something once it's done. But let's get into this, Banana Fish. Banana Fish episode one, come on. Trailer looked decent. Fuck it, huh? Where are we at? This is Afghanistan, not Iraq. <laughs> Clementine, sorry, I said Mary Jane. <laughs> Bombing again. Occupation. Has he been getting some dodgy drugs here? <laughs> or maybe that's the, the pills they take to uh, avoid getting uh, gas. This <laughs> guy, huh? Hey, 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 what's he doing? What's he doing? Oh my god, PTSD or what, man? Fuck it yeah, up. What the fuck? I see men go mad, man. On the battlefield. How long can you go killing people, man? Before it drives you mad, man. Banana fish. Is this is this like a? I'm sure banana fish is like a code name. I've seen a bunch of these. Um, it's like Jacob's Ladder, almost like Jacob's Ladder. Uh, have you ever seen that horror film? Well, horror film, but it's a psychological thriller slash horror. But is this some sort of like <laughs> MK Ultra or something? Banana fish is just a code name for a project or something. Interesting. Interesting. Los Angeles. The soundtrack is fucking banging. <laughs> this guy looks like Makishima Shogo with blonde hair. Oh, pack and eat. What is going on? We cut from that. What seemed to be a flashback to this. Some giant conspiracy. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get your fun somewhere, man. Ash. Padino. <laughs> More of those videos. 
Well, he's a YouTuber. <laughs> you fag. <laughs> Crime family or some shit. I'm sure calling someone a fag is the ultimate offense to those guys. The ultimate masculine in the ultimate masculinity. <laughs> Get to join me. Take your hands out of your boy. <laughs> Fuck here, now I'm man. All for etiquette and shit. Didn't he know his his dude his dad is in this line of business? About bumping people off. Okay, that's why. Just a rat not a member of the syndicate. Okay. I hope this is better than gangster. I hope this show is better than gangster, man. to use for me. <laughs> Interesting, man. Picture of the streets. He's an adoptive son, like, oh, what the fuck? I know I love you, sweetheart. You know I love... Is that, is that the kind of relationship? He, f he adopted him. He took him off the streets, put him to work, but he's like a more of a fuckboy. <laughs> Shorter. He's vindictive and gay. <laughs> so this guy, this kid's not like not gay, but he, that's why he's got such a thing against him. But it's only because he's been in. He's basically a slave almost. <laughs> oh shit! Nice, my brown buddy. Will owe you one. We've been dropped into this man, making references to things I don't know about yet. Good kid though. Skip. Let's pay the boy. Nice. <laughs> Good kid. With what happened? It does feel like they dropped us into this this guy's life. I gotta figure things out, what these little references are to certain things. Poor kids. It's gone. Is that a drug? Is that the drug they mentioned? Wartime. Banana fish.
do this to you. So is this sort of um, bloody hell? Hey, that's the link. What? But is banana fish some new unregulated drug or some shit? They're doing shit. Oh my days. <laughs> That's where it all starts, man. The big boss goes over your head. Dino's equals. Water. <laughs> <laughs> Blonde brat. <laughs> is he this? Is he the Reinhardt of this shit? He said, "Look here, but you got to play dirty if you want to beat him." Look at these fingers. Fingers look fine to me. Maybe he had the uh, surgery. The meds. Okay. How did this all come, come together, man? <laughs> Maybe they'll give us uh, more context. Figure out what it is. Is it a hallucinogenic drug or something like that? <laughs> what is this, a fucking Bond villain, man? <laughs> Blofeld. Really, really quickly, man. <laughs> Help me. I feel as though this guy wormed his way, like he positioned himself in, in a way to infiltrate this household. It's not he. It's not that he found him off the street randomly. It's because he wanted to be in his household. So he probably gave up his body. Next time, they can appoint. <laughs> That's how it is, cause he's he's on the trail, isn't it? <laughs> Arthur. That's like a loose cannon there, man. See us at New York. That case. Suicide? Yeah, man, that was fucking suicide. <laughs> Made to look like it. Captain. Jenkins. Lots of names we've been throwing around, man. It's gonna be taking a little time to remember more. Charlie. We haven't seen a single female character in this in this show so far. Feels weird. <laughs> Good thing to look really young. 
They don't trust adults. Ah, I see. Under control. <laughs> He's white, but he has control of everyone. It's, I noticed that. That why is this blonde white boy dictating to everyone? <laughs> I was wondering. It would seem weird that white boy was doing all this shit. Androgynous white boy at that. So he seems to be an informant, I guess. Like a, he's on the inside. He's informing for. Or are they just saying that he's got them under control? So he's already hidden it. Okay. Everyone seems to be on it. He's yours. Fuck it out, man. Keep him alive, yeah, so you can fucking stick your dick in him, man. <laughs> He's always loved Ash just like you. Is he the older uh, uh, Renton boy <laughs> type character who's been kicked out for the new model? <laughs> Drugged in Iraq with something bad. Hmm. Was it testing? Was it some government drug secret secret shit? I mean, he shot up his own man's. He's my big bro. Now nah, we get a little bit more. A little bit more. What I want to know is Papadino. What link does he have to it? Salinger. Banana fish at sea. Oh, interesting. Yeah, but that's got something to do with Salinger. Maybe it's just a... Music. What the hell is this? It's a gay bar. <laughs> is it me? I just saw one maid here. Why is it, why why is there no chick? <laughs> <laughs> He's like any other uh, edgy uh, <laughs> anime character. <laughs> Come on, man, this kid is so awkward. <laughs> Can I hold it? He's against killing, but I'm sure he has. Yeah. 
Hey, once upon a time, you were him as well. <laughs> Anybody touch his gun? I'm sure Papa Dino's touched his gun, fam. You know what I mean? <laughs> Fingers blown off. Okay. That that that's a little bit of a tidbit of information about the fingers thing. I see. I see how you you have to piece little bits together, right? It is shot. Three five seven Magnum. I like I like this fast pace. Little clues they had to kind of build the whole picture yourself. It means wildcat. He's totally wild. <laughs> More to him. He's trying to find banana fish. Oh, fuck it, huh? God damn, man. They act quick. Animation looks dope, though. <laughs> ruckus. Bring the ruckus. Bring the motherfucking ruckus. Ah, man, worst. <laughs> <laughs> this kid, man. My boy, man. This kid's got spunk. <laughs> this kid's a joker, man. You sleep food. They wanted this, man. If I fuck the interview. Oh my god, man. Little kid caught in the middle, man. Oh, is he gonna try fight? How good's his aim? Is he really that good of a sharpshooter? Oh, fuck here, though. No. Nice. <laughs> the devil lives out. <laughs> the day he met him. Mapper. <laughs> Shit, man. Now right, we get to see what badass he is. I like the aesthetic of this. The graffiti, all that shit. I know it's about gangs, but it, like, you that wouldn't permeate every fucking place, every scene, right? Hey, what? Uh, the guys. Uh, see, and someone else has gone over someone else's head. Dino said, leave him alive. This motherfucker, because he's so fucking jealous. Perfect day for banana fish. What is banana fish? Banana fish and MacGuffin, man. It's like One Piece. You know they always they give you a, 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 a MacGuffin or a red herring to follow, right? To, for a bunch of shit to happen. Banana for, for now, banana fish is this red herring or MacGuffin type shit. Interesting first episode. I don't know whether I'll continue it. Let me know how it goes. It's just started. Let me know if this show goes good. Please keep me up to date with this show. Like I always ask you guys, if I do a one-off reaction and this show continues, um, uh, be sure to keep me updated about how good it goes, that kind of thing. I'll check it out. So now, let's go on to um, what's next. What's next uh, in terms of, uh, you know, uh, mainstay animes, old animes, and seasons go. So right now, 
uh, as you, I've, I've, I've come off a bunch of seasonals right now. I came off Golden Kamoya, I came off Magalo, came off Seven Elite Sins. I'm still doing Steins Gate. Um, and now that now that they're coming kind of winding down, I'm going to limit my my seasonals now. So the only three I'm going to be doing right now are, of, of course, Steins Gate. It's going to continue for at least another 10 more episodes. Um, I've already started Middle Manager Tonigawa. So Middle Manager Tonigawa is going to be one of my seasonals. And my third and final seasonal. I'm going to be doing right up until October when Jojo comes, starts Jojo Part 5, is Attack on Titan Season 3. So for now, it's going to be Steins Gate, uh, Middle Manager Tonigawa, and Attack on Titan Season 3. So I hope that's a broad, like, it's, it's broad enough that you guys can enjoy at least some of them. Uh, as far as, um, you know, I've Space Brothers, you know, I've been doing Yu Kusho and Space Brothers as my mainstay animes. Yu Kusho, I was on episode 97, it came, it's coming to an end now. I've got maybe 10 more episodes left before it finishes. Something like that, ten or eight, nine or ten episodes left. Once that finishes, and once Space Brothers finishes, or which, whichever finishes first, which will be Yu Ku Show, uh, then my next two mainstay animes or old animes are going to be Mononoke and Paranoia Agent by Satoshi Kon. Uh, Paranoia Agent's been a long time coming, well overdue, so I'm going to be doing Paranoia Agent. Paranoia Agent's a short series, eleven to twelve episodes. Um, so I might actually, might actually start. Either of Mononoke and um, Paranoia Agent are both uh, short series. So when um, Yu Kusho finishes, I'll be starting either Mononoke or Paranoia Agent. Since I've already started Mononoke, I might just start that. And then by the time Space Brothers finishes, then I'll do Parano Paranoia Agent. Or whichever, whichever finishes first. It's possible a Mononoke will finish before I even finish Space Brothers. Because there's still quite a ways to go. So there's that. Um, I'll be doing the uh, when Gundam Origin si episode six comes out, OVA six, film six, whichever you want to call it. Gundam the Origin is coming out in July, so for movie weekend, I'm, I'm thinking I'm gonna uh, uh, resurrect movie weekend uh, co to coincide that with Gundam the Origin episode six. I'll be doing that, uh, guys. I've already reacted to Attack on Titan season two on my channel. I've got reactions and they're in the playlist, so you'll be seeing the playlist go up right now. Uh, Attack on Titan playlist is going to be somewhere up here. You're going to see my uh, playlist for. I'm trying to think. Some of my other Gundam. Gundam Origin stuff. Uh, you'll see the playlist for. And um, yeah, so it, those are what I'm going to be doing next for the foreseeable future. When October hits, um, Castlevania Season 2 on Netflix is going to come out. JoJo Part 5 is coming out. I'm going to be reacting to those. But for now, it's, it's, it's this list. So uh, to sum, sum it up. Uh, what's next is Mononoke, Paranoia Agent, um, Attack on Titan Season 3, uh, and I'll be continuing uh, Tonigawa. So, yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoy it and you're happy with that. Let me, if you want to uh, recommend something or you think I missed something out, let me know. Also, I haven't forgotten that I did start Rose of Versailles. Rose of Versailles is also on my list. I just have to look back on the list and revise the priority order in terms of you know in the in the time between me formulating these lists um, and and you know actually get into them in the between I get more recommendations for one over another so they, they do get pushed around slightly Mononoke I really responded well to so I decided to do that um, so yeah hope you guys enjoy it man and uh, if you want to recommend anything new or anything old or something I might enjoy and, and you've seen me respond to those things comment in that below but uh, apart from that let me know what you thought of uh, banana fish episode one have you read the manga you looking forward to it and thank you very much for watching peace